my channel, Sally Hearts Jack 80 here. Hey, lovey subbies, I hope you're having a wonderful Wednesday. So before I get started with today's show, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for all your beautiful comments on yesterday's video. Um, my video was about no longer collecting Barbie fashionistas. Um, it was a really hard decision for me to come to. I love Barbie. I will always love her. Um, I will still continue to to collect Barbie, made to move Barbies, um, and any other Barbie that I see that has leg articulation. But I will not be supporting the Barbie fashionistas anymore. Um, but also on that note, I want to say, um, if you guys still want to continue the fashionistas, you collect what you love to collect. I don't want, you know, my video to influence you not to collect what you love because you know what, that's the beauty about collecting something is it's your own personal collection and you could collect whatever it is you want or keep adding uh, to your collection. You know, I support all your guys' collections, your doll collections and whatever it is that you choose to collect. Um, I totally support that. So I just wanted to say, you know, it was no hate to Mattel and no hate to Barbie at all. It just, um, the fashionistas aren't the Barbie that I used to love. That's all I want to say. So thank you guys for all your, um, wonderful comments and, um, continue having fun collecting Barbie and keeping her a part of your life. So let's get on with today's show. Today's show, I'm going to be reviewing one of those fabulous, amazing dolls that I absolutely can't get enough of. And I'm talking about the WWE Superstar Dolls. And on today's show, I have the beautiful Eva Marie. Look at how gorgeous she is. I love her red hair. Super, super, super cute. Look at all that glare. That glare is really bugging me. <laughs> but she's so super cool. I've done reviews on Becky and Charlotte. And um, on the back, it gives you a little bio about Ava Marie and Eva Marie. And it also gives you a picture of the doll. I love her little face. It's really, really cute. I love her arched eyebrows. She is fierce. So the back of her box says her name's Eva Marie. Her signature style is all red everything. And her bio says the polarizing flame-haired Eva Marie is a WWE villain that fans adore. With a mix of viciousness and athletic prowess, she inspires awe in the ring. So let me bust this girl out of here because... I want to show you guys how fabulous these WWE Superstar dolls are. And if you get a chance to add them to your collection, I say absolutely add them. They are amazing. They are fabulous. The articulation is out of sight. After the Made to Move Barbie, these girls are my favorite when it comes to articulation. And I love their body sculpt. It's really, really cool. It's different. It's not the regular um, Barbie doll um, body. Um, so here she is. Uh-oh, she's got those things in her head. Those tea ties drive me crazy. <laughs> but here she is. She is beautiful. She's definitely given me some Little Mermaid glow up. Like, if you switch her outfit, this could be the Little Mermaid in a few years after she's already married to Eric and she has her little daughter, Melody. I mean, look at how cute she is. She's definitely got some Little Mermaid hair going on. I love it. Gotta comb it because she's got box hair. But she's super, super cute. Are you guys seeing the, the aerial vibes? <laughs> I love her black tank top. It's super adorable. It says all red everything because that's her signature style. Um, I love the shirt, but I wish the pants were a little different. They're like these gold stretchy material things. I kind of wish they would have incorporated red into her outfit. Like maybe made these like... um like a legging type, well, they are leggings, but not the gold, um, like, yucky stuff. <laughs> like, I really, really love this doll's top, but her leggings are just not my favorite. I'm not a huge fan of, like, gold clothes like this. Um, I don't know, just my crazy thing. <laughs> and then she has on these cute little sandal shoes, which have a heel on them, but the heel is like one solid little, what do you call that thing? Like a chunk. So it's super, super cute. And like I said, she is fully posable. You could sit this girl down. She bends at the, uh-oh, she's got some stuff around her. Eva, okay, she bends at the elbow, which is always 
do you bend at the elbow? You're supp okay, her arms twisted around. So she bends at the elbow. She is flexible and bendy at the wrist, which is amazing. Also her shoulders. And she is just a really super cool, I don't understand how this is tied around her. Okay, there we go. She comes with the cuff bracelet on this arm. I mean, they're just really, really fabulous, fabulous dolls. Now, as I've been going around Target and Walmart, I have not seen them in stock just in my area, and I'm kind of getting freaked out. Um, are they getting rid of them, or are we getting a new wave, or what's going on? I certainly hope these beautiful girls are not going away, but um, they're gorgeous. And once again, they're made by Mattel. I, you know, I just don't understand how Mattel could put so much fabulousness into this doll. But by the way, thank you, Mattel, for making these gorgeous ladies. I just wish that my homegirl Barbie could be made like this. I mean, I just want her back. I want her posability back. Um, but thank you anyway, Mattel, for making this great line of WD WWE Superstar Dolls. They are super gorgeous, and they are super stunning. So these guys retail, well, if you could find them at Walmart, I mean, not at Walmart, at Target. I still have not seen them in Walmart around where I live, but at Target, they retail for $14.99. If you could still find them in your local Targets, because they're gone from mine, um... And I think the last time I checked at Target, they had Charlotte on clearance, and she was like $6, which is a super good buy. I got Eva way back at Toys R Us, and I think I paid 6 bucks for her, which isn't bad for these dolls. Not bad at all. So, um, I don't know. I haven't checked Amazon to see if you could get them on there. You probably can, because you could get almost anything on Amazon. So, I'll definitely have to check that out and see if these ladies are still on Amazon. So, there you guys go. So that is my Wednesday show, my review of WWE Superstars, Eva Marie doll. Love these girls. Definitely, definitely get your hands on some of these dolls. They are amazing. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and being a part of my channel. Thank you for making this such fun to do. I love having a channel where I could talk to other collectors about what I, my dolls, that I love them, about what we all love. So thank you guys so much and I absolutely appreciate it. So remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this WWE superstar world, I tell you, she could be, I'm digging, I'm getting, she's claws playing as the Little Mermaid, I'm telling you. <laughs> Eva Marie world, you guys have a magical day, and I will see you tomorrow for Throwback Thursday. Bye-bye, guys. Thank <laughs> you.